Hey guys, this is Masquerade. Welcome to Sims 4. We're going to be playing, where is it? Cats and Dogs. It came out today. Alright, so we're just going to jump right into it. We are going to make us a Sim, and then we're going to make a cat and a dog. That is the plan. Well, she looks cool. Okay, we'll pick her. I think I'm going to change your eye color. Eye color. There we go. I don't play these games very often. But we have some new hairstyles I want to see. Mm, not bad. Well, that one's pretty cool. Ooh, look at this giant hair. <laughs> awesome. It's about time I finally got my hair in the game. There's some here with these really cute bows. And what's this? Just short? Oh, tied in a messy bun in the back. That's awesome! The bows are cute, but I love the big hair. And there's more? Wow. Ooh, the long hair is pretty. It's got some highlights in it, too. The double hair is cool. Cat ears! The long curly hair right here I like. That's that's pretty close to my hair. There we go. Hmm. No, let's go. Oh. Cool. You look very lovely. All right. Let's see. Master mixologist. Nah. What are the animal goals we have here? Friend of the animals. Sim wants to befriend animals and the animal affection. Relationships with animals begin at higher values. Awesome. Um. Not loner. Let's go self-assured. No, I didn't want loner. Uh, geek? Couldn't be happier. Cat lover and dog lover. I'm definitely a cat lover. <laughs> and... I believe we have some new clothes in? Ooh, the patchwork's kind of cool. Ooh, that's really pretty. Some pretty nice selection of clothes. Oh, nice. Let's see, I've always been more of a practical kind of gal. So, something in here that's practical. Like the witch or the zombie schoolgirl. Is always a practical choice. Let's see. There's no specific outfit I usually gravitate towards, and it's actually been a while since I've played. So I'm just kind of refreshing what I have to go through. Mm, I always like that one, but we typically start off in a pretty plain Jane. Oh my word, do I try to get an apartment to stay in my shoe now? I don't think I will. <laughs> this short dress and the boots. Awesome. Um. Do, 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 do. I promise we'll get to the game. Ah, might as well go as plain as you can be. What new shoes do we have? Well, those are cool. And some flats. Kitty cat flats! Oh, they're cute! Oh. We got some new stuff here. Let me see. A kitty cat bracelet. Very cute. And some nice beads there, which I think fits the outfit just a little bit more. And let's name her... Cameron. I don't like that Cameron. Madeline. Gia. I like Gia. And Gia Hansen. Perfect. Awesome. Uh, voice. Dope and cooler. Oh, no. Works for me. And you're going to walk uh -huh. like that. Let me see your other outfits. 
No. <laughs> That's no formal outfit, hon. I've always liked this one. Let's give you these shoes. Socks! How dare you! Socks with sandals. Okay. And those work for pajamas. That works for, for party wear and bathing suit. Awesome. I think we're set there. Now let's make us some pets. We'll start with a doggy. Let me see doggy. Oh! Oh my gosh! It's so fluffy and cute. Crap! What what kind of dog was this? It was a um um I know it's a sheep dog. Filter breeds. Wow. They weren't kidding when they said they wanted every breed of dog. Oh, that's just the coat color. <laughs> Adobe sheep sheep dog. Let me see the specific breeds here. Is there an Airedale? Nice! An Akita? Oh, American Eskimo. I'm sure there's an Akita in here somewhere. Malamute. There's the Akita! Akita! Australian Cattle Dog. A uh, Hypno Dog, the Australian Shepherd. There's a Beagle. Oh my gosh. A uh, Bichon Frise. Very cute. Black Russian. Border Collies. Border Collies are pretty cool. Um, let's see. Oh, oh, a chow. A chow chow. And a collie. And a dachshund. <gasps> You're not a very long doggy. But it'll, it'll do, I guess. I mean, a dingo. I don't think those are legal to have as pets. Oh, yes, an adobe. With ears and a tail. My kind of dogs. A fox. <gasps> we can own foxes. I'm sure those are, those are illegal in a few places. Of course, they have the German Shepherd. Uh, the Giant Schnauzer. Great Pyrenees. Havanese. Icelandic. I'm looking for the Newfies. Where's my new fees? Have to go down a little bit more. Miniature poodle? How miniature? Oh, so cute! There they are, the Newfoundland. Oh, big doggy. Very big doggy. We have new kinds of tails for some reason, but I think the Newfie tail looks just fine. And pet clothing. We can dress up our pets. I think this is the first. Um, for the Sims. Let me see what exactly we got here. Oh, cute. I like it. <gasps> Superhero doggy. Super llama doggy. <laughs> awesome. And the shark vest. And the sweater. That's amazing. But you're a newfie. You don't need a sweater. You've got that double coat there. So I think we'll go with a regular collar. Let's make it red for visibility. Oh my gosh. Ellen, I can animate you? Oh my. <laughs> oh. This way I can see your tummy because I can recolor your tummy. Look at... Let me slow you up. That face. <laughs> that face that's awesome what do we name our newfie dog <laughs> just name him dog <laughs> um monty you look like a monty monty dog let's see i can change your physique but why would i want to do that and traits harry well yes <laughs> Newfies are very hairy dogs. Let's see. <clears throat> I 
What else is a Newfie? <clears throat> Newfies are loyal. As good doggy. Turn around so I can see you. <coughs> there we go. Oh, that face. And... Couch potato. <coughs> as big as they are, I hear Newfies do kind of lounge around a lot. Okay, so we have a Newfie. And now we are going to make a kitty. Why not have the whole package in the house? Ooh, look at the Calico Kitty. Okay. And while I love those kitties, I have a weakness. Where are they? Javanese, not quite. I'm looking for the Siamese. No! Raccoons? No way! <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. I have a weakness for Siamese! Oh, so cute! But very vocal. Oh, not quite cross-eyed. And of course, very pretty blue eyes. Oh, and we can mix breeds? Oh, that's cool! Ah, yes, the Savannah. I got mixed feelings about the Savannah, but that's not quite what this video is for. Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, the costumes are so cute! Oh, Toast Kitty! <laughs> so cute! Oh, I realize I'm not picking the genders of the dog, of the pets, but that's okay. I'm not really caring too much about <laughs> Sandwich and sushi! Sandwich and sushi! Well, for now, let's just get you in a collar. I think we're gonna put you in a red collar very nice or maybe we should put you in a blue collar matches your eyes a little yeah awesome and what should we name the cat bacon <laughs> Burger. <laughs> you know what why not my sister and I actually took care of a stray cat and we and we named him burger because we just couldn't tell if they were um... oh burgers a boy and the dog's a boy, too. Um, well, you know what? You look like a boy dog. I really hate to discriminate, but you look like a boy dog. So we're going to make this a kitty. Oh, 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 oh. We can make him kittens. We can make him kittens. <gasps> oh, how cute. Oh, gosh. Well, I think we're going to make him an adult for this playthrough. But, oh, my gosh. Can I have a newfie puppy? Oh. <gasps> Oh, it's so fat and fluffy! Oh, oh as cute as they are. I think we're going to stick with the grown-ups. We'll definitely do a puppy and kitty playthrough, but first... Oh. Okay, so they're Siamese, so they're talkative. Oh, naturally. Yeah, if... I've got about uh, three reasons why you should probably rethink uh, Siamese if you like a not quiet house. Meow! 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 They talk and they talk and they talk. Let's see. I think you're going to be a clever kitty. Siamese are pretty smart. Spoiled. <laughs> Scully them hardly changes their behavior. <laughs> um, ooh, a prowler. Send them out. They might come back with something they found. Ooh. Oh, a frisky kitty. They're more active around other cats. They like to pounce and run. A free spirit. Well, that's certainly a Siamese. Guys enjoy walking around the world. Don't worry, they'll always come home for the food. Fluffy. They hack a pair of balls more often. Ah. Um, aloof. Affectionate. Ooh, they love their owners. Oh, Siamese are very affectionate towards their owners. Not so much towards strangers. Oh, I am in pet heaven, you guys. <laughs> Alright. I think we've got everything. Does the game think we have everything? I think so. Let me see a couple other poses. Aww. Aww. I love it. <laughs> Monty, that face. But alright. Save and play. And then I believe we're going to go to the new neighborhood of Brightfield. I think it was called. 
when you're ready, game. Brid Brindleton, Brindleton Bay. Let's see what we have. I see a blank lot there. A one bed, one bath there. I mean, otherwise, I'm probably going to end up uh, dead grass aisle. I, I know it's not a residential lot, but eh. I may not have a choice. We're just going to have to start in the Bedlington Boathouse. Oh, I see. So these are different districts that we can go to. Sable Square. Whiskerman's Wharf. <laughs> Very cute. This is Cavalier Cove. And the island over here is Deadgrass Isle. That's fine. All right. Let's move in. Uh, furnished, please. And let's see what Cats and Dogs has to offer us. This looks like a cute little seaside town. Uh, I guess it's the one downside to Sims 4. Like, you're stuck with these neighborhoods. You can't make your own. You can't, um... And they're all the same people, and they're all connected. I guess that sounds cool on paper, but what if I don't want them connected? Alright, everybody. Well, I think the first thing we're going to need is pet supplies, if our house doesn't have them already. Oh, I can whistle for my pets? Right, because I can't actually control my pets. Oh! <gasps> Oh, <gasps> you playing with the dog already? Oh, Monty. Okay, hit pause for a second. Let's check the house because I think we're going to need supplies for the pets. Mm, we're certainly looking like it so far. Where's the upstairs button? There it is. Yeah. Fortunately, there's a lot of space for both pets. I think. Own businesses? Oh, no, no, we're not going to worry about that. Right? I wanted to make a vet. But first, we need to see what exactly dogs and cats can give us. Okay. So. Come on. We're going to go here, and we're going to look for pets. Aha! Uh -huh, pet stuff. So, food dishes. Ooh, automated dispensers. Wait a minute, how much money do I have? Oh, a modest amount. Pet beds. And litter boxes. Toys, furniture, and miscellaneous. Well, let's see. We're definitely going to need bowls for both Mr. Tinkle's litter box, a cat's and poopin', a litter matic scoop free, and litter laser self cleaning litter box for 400. Not too bad, considering, but I think we're going to try to go as cheap as we can at the moment. Okay, so we'll get this pet bed. We're actually going to put the pet beds upstairs. Unless they want to sleep in the bed. There's no problem with that. I don't know. My, my pets can go on my furniture. That's perfectly fine. And in beginning... Ooh, big bed. We're going to put that over here. And that'll be Monty's bed. As for pet bowls... They're going to go over here by the kitchens. Let's see. Those cost quite a bit. We'll get a modern pet bowl for both. Kitty and doggy. And the litter box can go in the bathroom. Which I believe we have ample space for it. There we go. And toys. Tennis ball. Just little ball balls. The cat dazzler. Ooh, and hoops. Okay, so we could teach them tricks and stuff. Outdoor pet storation device. Oh, little things for... Okay. Obstacles. Okay, that's cool. Alright, so we can... Yeah, that's cool. 
Let's see, I think we're going to get the small chest for right now. Put that there. And fill it with toys later. As for furniture... Oh, a cat scratcher. Oh, we're definitely going to need those. And pet stations. Oh, absolutely. Let's see. I think the basic one will do for now. And I believe that also doubles as a scratching post. I think so. And what's in miscellaneous? I see decorations. Lots of pet-related decorations. Decals. Pile of the Sims Daily. <laughs> I believe that's a decoration. Perfect for the uh, feeding stations. Decals and accents. No dogs and no cats. All puppers welcome. Cats rule the house. Oh, and some medical supplies for the vet station, which we will do in the near future. But right now, I want to play with my dog and cat. Ceramic cats. Pet carriers. Well, we may need one. Hopefully, there's a vet in the area we can go to. Bop. Uh, that... Hole, hole, mouse in the wall. Ha <laughs> That's cool! Let's see, some more vet equipment. And more decals. Oh, which I can get by unlocking the vet skills. Okay. So that should be enough, but I really don't have any dog toys. Which is a little disheartening. Maybe we can get some. Buy a squeaky toy, we don't need to. Take dog on a walk. Well first, let's fill everybody's foods. Fill all pet bowls. Let's see, what do I need to do for this? Have one pet in your household, be friends with one animal, be friendly with animals 12 times. Cool! Alright, and since I can't control the animals, can I see... Meow. I can't really see what they need. Play with Monty. Play with Monty. Let me see. Let me see if we could train you guys. Ask to go potty, brush, pet, praise. Lex on one on the couch. Comfy seats required. Simstagram pet. Go for it. Oh, brushing the kitty. Hopefully they happy kitty. Hmm? Oh. I need to get as close to that face as possible. Oh, really? And I don't think I have any filters yet. Oh, I have a couple. No filters fine for right now. Um, there we go. That'll do for right now. Oh, no, no, no. Put there. And... Can I... No. Oh, I wanted to zoom in closer. I guess I can't. Boo. That's fine. I just want to take a picture of Monty's very grumpy face. And 
And now Monty's on Instagram, and I have a photograph skill. Monty's gained 20 Instagram followers. Aww. Can I train you, Kino? Training! Let's train you to sit. Pet training skill. Oh, cool! I could probably put an obstacle course here in the backyard. It's okay. Newfies are actually pretty easy to train. Shouldn't take long. Monty's doing a sit! Sit down. Sit. Sit, Monty. Sit, Monty. What, you need an incentive with treats? Sit. Sit. Monty. <gasps> Good dog. <laughs> oh, Monty yes. can heal? Yes. Cool. Amba. 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 Sit. Sit. Sit, Monty. Good boy. Oh, person with food just showed up. And the neighbors come to say hello? Let's stop for now and... Say hello to the neighbors. <laughs> new neighborhood means new sims. Hello. <laughs> so <all. laughs> Bimby. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm Kim Angor. Slap show. We're right next to the road, which is a little weird. Well, it's definitely gonna make filming a little awkward. Samzo. Clevite Howie, Burger, make sure you get along with everybody. Oh. Really? What was that? I'm mostly wanting to see if the dog and cat get along. I'm sure they will. Newfies tend to get along with most anything. Can I ask him to leave? I'd like to play with my pets. <laughs> Share love of cats. What are you doing? I'd like for you to leave. Request song. Oh, Burger, sing a song for me. I don't care about the human. I actually care more about the cat. Burger. Wow, <laughs> That's a Siamese, all right. <laughs> oh, but the kitty. Oh, but Burger. Burger, a cute kitty. Clean up toys? That's weird. <laughs> Monty just fell asleep. Uh, let's see. Where's... Where did the toy box go? There it is. Get toy or burger. Just any toy, I guess, will do. Let's see. It looks like a ball. 
I saw laser pointers in the, um... In the trailers. Oh, taking the dog for a walk. And Burger just left the property. Just gone. Oh, there he is. Oh, hey, we got like a cute Aura. little... Algorithm. Oh, it's like a neat little boardwalk out here. Well, I guess if Burger wants to explore the area, he can explore the area. And... <gasps> Seagulls. Mm, pretty nice fishing spot. And what's this? Send pet to explore. Requires pet training level 3. Wow. It's really nice out here. Wow. We got seagulls and... Oh, those are pipers! <gasps> little sandpipers or little plovers. Oh, so cute. That's an awesome touch. I love seabirds. Okay, but we need to get our butts back home. Because Monty's just sitting all by his lonesome. And let's take him for a walk. Let's see. Can I take him for a walk? Encourage to mate with. <laughs> We're not doing that. Let's see. Pet care. Go for a short walk. Let's go. Burger should be fine. Where's Burger? Oh, Burger made it home. Burger's just gonna hang out. And I actually don't know how to get you to leave. Okay, Monty, let's go for a walk. Uh, the dog should be right in front of the owner. If they're right behind the owner, they're not going to really um, want to keep going for a walk. But oh well. Go for a nice walk. Going to check out the area. Oh, he healed. Good Monty. Where to now? We're going to go on the beach. It's actually kind of nice that we're right next to the beach. Newfies love water. Love it. A good walk. Nice. So we could just wander into other people's properties? That's kind of weird. Well, there's that other dog that was there. Stray. Fish. <laughs> the dog's name is Fish. Cool. Play laser pointer. Oh, and we're just gonna go back. Ugh, what? The nausea. What's your problem? You're fine. Are are you not having fun? Monty's gonna be doing okay. Monty loves the walk. It does look like a really nice area. Are we going on to the beach? Nice. Excuse us, don't mind us. Oh, you guys! If you guys are on the beach and you see sand plovers, make sure you're um. Make sure you don't wander too close. Not just scaring the birds, but a lot of them just nest on the beach. So you need to make sure that you're not like. You seem to don't want to walk your dog. Anyway, you, you need to stay away from plovers in places that say, Hey, don't walk here because of plovers. You don't want to step on a nest by accident. It just sucks for the birds. Real bad. Come on, he seems to really enjoy walking. Really seems to love going to the beach. Encourage money to do business. Sounds good to me. 
Because I actually can't tell what his needs are. Go potty! No? Oh, I guess I need to... House break, little guys. So cool. That's so cool that we have plovers. Alright, you hungry? Time to go home. <laughs> the burger has quite made sure that he's head of the household. Walks over. Praise. Oh, do you need to... Go potty. Uxaloy. Yibs! Bivazi! Oh, he's just happy, Doug. Okay. Go potty. Go potty. Right there. It's perfectly fine. Do I need a specific spot for them to... There we go. Good boy. Jeff and Banahu, Pelka. Continue sit training. Uh, Amba. 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 Oh. Sit down. Oh, so I guess we're all just walking onto each other's property. Yes. Yes. Um. Um. Sit, boy. Oh. <laughs> Plus. I wonder, Burger, can we train you? Uh. Oh yeah. Now. Uh. Now the neighbors are here. Okay, we're not gonna worry about training. We need to say hello to our neighbors wherever they may be. One jerk just left his food here, because of course he did. Justin Delgado. Might as well say thanks for coming right after this. And we'll see what I can do to... We have, like, no skills. I guess I'll whip up, like, a salad or something. Garden salad. Monty's coming in for a bite to eat, and I think Burger just dashed out of the house. He's in the red, but I can't tell why. Do you need to go potty? Yep. Well, good boy. Girl. And there they go. Give give burgers some privacy. So I don't know. It's a little frustrating that I can't, you know. I mean, I should at least be able to tell what what um what my pets are feeling at any point in time. Oh, Burger's going for the cat tower. Zoom. I think they finally left. Dude, you walked away! I'm not liking this open door policy in the neighborhood. Ugh, Sims are silly. <laughs> and Monty just fell asleep right there on the. Oh. 
Don't you dare. Oh, gross. Ugh. Yuck. Need to teach you to cook better. Monty, you don't need to sleep on the kitchen counter. I mean, on the kitchen grounds. You don't have to do that. And salad. Actually looks really gross. Burger, where'd you go? Oh, you're on your table. That's fine. I guess I can leave the toy there for right now. So I guess it's being part of the household. Eh. Monty. Monty could probably use a brushing. And I have a shower, so I can't really, uh... Monty, what you doing? Let's give you a brushing. Monty, good doggy. There we go. We'll help you feel better. And then talk to doggy. Abshani. Pinaroo, bluff problem. Frody ma rufe, blinzel feeb. Binkapa sigluna. Chinosa bombis knilzia crutes, eh? Tronjala jabi. Look at him hanging under her every word. What a good boy. Shorg. Get to know? Get to know Monty. Hug Monty. Hug the dog. Hug the big newfie. Oh, oh, so cute. How about you not jump on the counter, Burger? Timothy Varpasa. Get down. Burger don't care. Can I get to know Monty? <laughs> Milestone complete! Oh, and <laughs> burger's on top of the fridge! That's actually kind of awesome. Be friends with five animals, be companions with one animal, successfully train out two misbehaviors. Burger. I actually don't want you up there. Down. Bentley? Oh, Fulmer uh, to cobbler. Down. Go burger. And let's get the laser pointer out. Okay, this I need to see. It'll get burger off the counter at least. Oh, the red dot. Get it, get it, get it. <laughs> Aww. Very cute. Oh, that was fun. I guess you're gonna have to tell him a thousand times. Burger. No. Off the counter. Oh, Langy, the laugh. Burger don't care. Burger don't give a shit. Well, what's wrong? Afflin, Skuna Mitzel. Lonely. Pick up. Arnarb, Quaba, 
Tune up. Rissalek Kumbar. Pardu skin saploche. Come on, I need to hug my kitty. Burger, come back. Burger. It's the other reason I really hate Sims 4. Just sometimes they don't move. You give them a command and then they don't. And Burger's gone. Burger is on her boardwalk, and you can't do nothing about it. Mm, she is getting a little tired. You're not particularly close to Gia. Oh well. Need a cat. Maybe. Maybe someday. What are you doing? Pick up the cat. Pick up your cat. Burger. Burger cat. Kitty. And on the counter again. Because if me, this is Burger's house. Burger can do whatever they want. Oh, no, Monty. Oh, so cute. Pick up kitty. Now. Up. Oh. And now you're just holding the cat. Huh. And pet. Pet kitty. Hmm. On the stretch. One pick up and then pets and cuddles. Burger! Cat. Kitty. Trying to pet you. Oh, Jarina, old name. No. Aww. New beam short. What are you praising him for? Don't praise him for jumping on the counter. Like a jerk. Okay, so the cats are very cute. The dogs are very, very cute. Um, I'll certainly be exploring more of the place. I was really hoping to do more than just ooh and ah at the cute Bobby and the cute kit kitty 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 cute kitty. Whoa, camera. Okay. But yeah, this is uh, this is cats and dogs. So we got so it's a little frustrating not being able to control them or at least see what needs they have. Like that's actually kind of annoying that I can't see what their needs are. But um, I mean it's fun to play with them. It's going to be a challenge to um to train them. But the big thing I want to do is I want to be able to play a vet. So maybe I'll do that for another video. Um. Yeah, why not? I think for the next video I'll make a I'll make my own veterinary clinic and treat some dogs and cats. It sounds like it could be fun. So um I think I'm gonna stop the video here. So lots of breeds of dogs and cats, fun ways to dress them up and lots of personalities that they can have, and now people the Sims Forbes I go to can shut up about there not being any pets. So thank you guys very much for watching. Leave a like if you like what you see. Subscribe to see more. Leave in the comments down below what you would make in Cats and Dogs. And I shall see you again real soon. Thank you.